Hi everyone, welcome back to The Bent Knitter. So I just wanted to give an update on what I've been working on. So I was able to finish the scarf that I was knitting with, with the wands that I showed the past couple of weeks. The yarn that I went decided to go with was actually a super bulky yarn. Um, so Bernate, Softy Chunky, that's what I went with. And again, I went with uh, Slytherin color, so I got a nice gray and green. The reason why I went with uh, the chunky was just because the ones are a little bit thicker, so it was a little bit easier just to use thicker yarn instead of something super fine. I didn't want it to make it really holy, you know, or see through. And it's a little bit different than the movies just because movies, they're very big, they're usually made on circular needles, so I wanted to do something in the vein of Slytherin, but not exactly like the movie movie scarf. So I was able to finish it. It was very nice and very quick. But ta da! As you can see, it's all nice, big, and bulky and thick, which is nice. It was actually a lot of fun and very interesting to use the needles just because, or the wands, I should say. My apologies. The wands. Just because they are fun to use, but they're also heavier because. A lot, it's something that you don't really think about until you're using something else that wasn't intended for it to be used as knitting needles, but they're definitely heavier than the normal knit needles that I, at least I've come accustomed to. So it's definitely very fun and very interesting just to kind of get used to the weight and get, get used to the yarn. It was also a little bit inter interesting because like I mentioned, there are both two different gauges. So luckily, um, if you can see in the scarf, the stitching was pretty, you know, consistent, so even though there was two different gauges, so very, it doesn't show through, which was nice, so it actually became a very nice scarf, but that was another challenge just to kind of go over with the wands was the different gauges, but I would definitely make another one. I'm, I'm definitely considering it. Let me know if I should, in the comments below, make another the scarf for the wands and what house I should make or what colors I should use for the next one um, because it was definitely a lot of fun to do the use the wands for it so it was definitely a lot of fun but also what I'm working on now is a little bit different is I'm going to back to a bigger project like I, I am one to do I'm actually going to use some very bright, very colorful yarn to do a blanket. So I've started that, and I I'm working on it. It's finer yarn. I'll put the all the details in the description below for both yarns that I'm using, uh, for both for the scarf and for the, for the blanket. It's nice to nice to do something very colorful, so that way I don't have to change yarn all the time, which is nice. But that's what I'm working on. Any questions, comments, com let me know in the the comments below what house should i do next bye